Thursday, September 20th, showing you what's going on in the shop. As usual, Russell is not in. It's just me, Josh, and Nico holding it down. Um, I have got the Bowies all, the 119s all glued up. I will be cleaning them up, hopefully getting them for hand sanding. And then hopefully on to the big set of Bowies for the groomsmen's gifts. Those were heat treated Saturday. Thank you, Russell. And I will be, I, th I believe that they also ran through their tempers. So what I'll end up doing is trying to get some grinds in on them just so I can clean them up and get them down to final shapes. Uh, hopefully get them starting in the process for handles. That will be the major part of my day. Today's also Industry Tuesday, so I'm hoping that we have a good busy day of sharpening. That will be the major part of today. Other than that, let's go ahead and go into the showroom, see what we have going on in there. Bam, 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 bam. What's up, buddy? Yo, yo. Hope y'all had a good weekend. So we got some Miyabi Evolution slicers in. So these are going to be pretty good for fish or just boneless slabs of meat. Right on. But yeah, they're pretty sweet. Easy to clean. Just walked in, so they're not in just yet. We'll get them in, but by the time you guys see this, they might even be some. Other than that, y'all, we're just going to head off today that way. We'll see you the rest of the week. Appreciate all of you liking, subscribing, commenting. Keep doing that so we can interact with y'all. It help, helps us with the channel, and we'll get back to you later on on the next one. Take care, guys. Good morning. It is Wednesday, September 21st, and today I will be working on one of Nico's designs. Let me hold it right. Uh, I got a little bit of this ground on Saturday. He picked out a beautiful piece of walnut for it. So I'm gonna see if I can get uh, that at least ready for handle today. The bulk of what I will be doing today is restarting a, a leather saya that did not work from last week. Um, so, and I have to finish it in four days because where I'm not here next week and it's due by the end of September. So I will be focusing on the leather saya more than anything today and working on this knife in between while things are drying and gluing and such. So that's my day. Here's Daniel with hopefully something much more exciting than that. Hey y'all, just to get you caught up to speed with what's going on uh, in my realm. Yesterday we had a great amount of sharpening which my buddy Josh helped us out with. Uh, I appreciate him and definitely help me stay on task with other things. I was able to get two of the bowies down to shape. Um, I've got to go one more grit and then I'll be uh, hand sanding those guys. And then I've got to get two more uh, down to shape. A little bit tedious on the process, but I've got one of the ones that uh, have the same handle shape. So I'll be able to just match that and go at it. Uh, that will be the majority of my day along with whatever else comes in like usual. We don't have anything to show you in the showroom today, so I apologize. Uh, hopefully we'll have something later on this week and talk to you then. Take care y'all. September 22nd and I got the majority of the Saya uh, put together so it's it's glued I have a strap to add on basically for retention and that will get folded over um, and then I'll, that'll be basically the next thing I do is I'll glue this up stitch it all and then attach the snap uh, at the end um, I also got a little work done on one of Nico's designs um, it's up to 120, so I'll try to get it, it polished today as well. We are down Nico today. He has jury duty, so it's Josh Daniel in the shop today. It, well, and me, I guess. Uh, <laughs> and so uh, we'll kind of have to bounce back and forth a little bit as, as today goes on, just uh, covering for him. He's he's a, the hardest person to deal with out in the shop, honestly, because he, he does the most of the customer interaction. So. I'll make myself available for anything that, that's needed. So, without further ado, here's Daniel with what he's got going on. Hey y'all, uh, just to get you caught up, I will be hand sanding today all of these bad bowies. Basically, I will have that on my plate for the ma majority of the day. Uh, I'll also try and grind on the D2 bowies now that the second temper is done on them. But we also had uh, one of the two customs for a customer come out. This is the CPM uh, little uh, hunter he asked for. I've just got to take this up a couple of grips, uh, grits, 
put it uh, to a buff forge finish and be ready since he's not having a handle on it. And then this was a Bowie for stock along with other Bowies I've got going for stock. Um, once I get to a point with the groomsman's gifts on leather, I'll be doing pretty much all the leather for all the Bowies you've been seeing for stock that haven't been done yet. So uh, that will be the major part of my day today. And then on the future stuff, uh, that is it for me. I will basically be making sure just like Russell, whatever we can do to kind of spread the team around and keep uh, everything good, we will. But without further ado, we've got Josh. Hey What's guys. up, buddy? We have something really, really cool today. So we have the new 2022 Gold Class Mini Osborne. I'm really excited about this. It comes with a Ayer Dama Steel blade, a Arctic Storm fat carbon fiber scale, and blue anodized bolsters, along with a floating gold plated backspacer. This knife, the design kind of pulls from Norse and uh, Baltic Sea mythology and overall just a really cool blade this one is number 2709 you can kind of see that there very cool all right well i uh, know that's not in stock just yet but we'll get it wrapped up in there that's going to be it for us today guys make sure you're interacting with us and we'll get back to you as soon as possible we'll see you on the next one which will be tomorrow nico should be back unless they put him in uh prison hopefully not then we'll just do hashtag neo uh nico Talk to you later, guys. Dude. Good morning. It's Friday, September 23rd, and I did a preliminary little acid test on our Magna Cut to see how dark it can get. Um, I will be acid etching Jackson's knife today after I do a little bit of buffing, and I will also be finishing the polish on Nico's Giotto. Uh, he wasn't around yesterday to see the progress on it, so he'll be really excited. Um, and Josh and I also have some outside the shop stuff to do today, um, as well as we're celebrating Nico's second anniversary today, so that'll take a little bit of the day as well. Um, but super congrats to Nico. Uh, we appreciate him being here and everything he does. Um, so that's my day. Here's Josh with his update. Hey guys, so I have six knives here. All of them have some hintang handles that I've been working on. Here are a few of them just to show. So I'll be taking those down to shape and that's my day. Here's Daniel. Hey y'all, just to get you caught up with what's going on in my world, I have got this one right here, hand sanded as far as the bowies go. And it took me a while because of the guard, but I've got these three left to go. Yesterday, Josh and I were pretty tied up with a lot of customers just because we didn't have Nico in. He is back, we will be celebrating his second year anniversary. Uh, but I should be on these and uh, forward with more than that, hopefully on to grinding some of the other bowies. That will be the most part of my day. Let's go ahead and go on into the showroom and see what's going on in there. Hey, buddy. Yo, yo. So we got this really cool custom chef knife with the leather side that was just finished for one of our customers. It's really a, I don't know, it's just a cool size. Right on. But yeah, this is all I have right now. Cool. All right, well, hopefully we get some more things in, guys. Other than that, we'll uh, wrap up today and see you tomorrow on the last one to wrap up the week. Peace. Good morning. It is Saturday, September 24th, and today I will be getting a, a final polish on Nico's knife, and I hope to get the handle on it. Uh, you'll see some of the fruits of my labor later on as, as Nico will show you that knife. And I got Jackson's knife with a handle on it, so the goal is to get this one completely done today. Here, I'll hold it still so you can see it. Uh, get it completely done because I'm going to Alaska on Tuesday and I won't be able to finish it after that. Um, so, hope to get it done today so he, he will literally probably pick it up within the hour of me finishing it. Um, so that's my plan. Uh, here's Josh with what he's got going on. Hey guys, so what, I've going, uh, what I have going on today, this handle is gonna go on this knife. This is a hybrid bolster and a Koa ferrule spacer thing. 
right here. Also, those knives that I mentioned yesterday are all fitted up. They just need some carving gluing up. That's my day, and here's Daniel. Hey y'all, uh, just letting you know I'm getting my butt kicked by these Bowie guards. I've got two more done. I've got one about midway through and then I'll take care of the one for stock. That is the majority of my day. Again, I will be working on the Bowies that are for the groomsmen's gifts over here. I should get some grinds off of them to get the scale off and that should be the majority of my day. Uh, along with whatever else comes in. So let's go ahead and go into the showroom and talk with Nico. What's up, buddy? Oh yeah, we got a new carry knife that's going in stock today. It's a beautiful redwood handle. Ooh, ooh. I like this one, guys. Yeah. Beautiful Bowie done by Russell. It's got a Kydex sheath, uh, leather strap with it right there. Yeah, so it'd go cross draw either side. It's pretty sweet. Right on. In stock already? No, but it will be by the time y'all see this. Right on, guys. So this video will get uploaded here today shortly. Uh, thank you for being with us this week. As always, like, subscribe. Make sure you're hitting those things. It helps us out. Interact with us just so that way we can get activity on the YouTube. And any questions you guys have, we hope to uh, basically answer those up pretty quick. Thanks for hanging out. You all have a good weekend, and we'll see you next time. Take care.